Hello, dear viewer, and welcome back to Tim Tim with me, Jalanon, and Learn Never Gaming. We are going to try to find our way onto an airship eventually. I thought there was... Let's see, where we're looking... Okay, I have to go further south. Okay, well... Hmm. I was going to try to find those kids that were missing from the school. I thought they were closer to Arisola. Hmm. So I might need to go and do that. Yeah, yeah. Do I want to? It's a little bit a ways back. It's quite a ways back. Hmm. Or I could do the main quest now. Yeah. Alright. To the airship. Well, now it's lag spike or something. Hmm. Alright then. Who do I talk to over here? I guess whoever this belongs to. Adia Ture? Hmm. Who are you and why are you bothering me? I'm Jalanon. Congratulations. Now excuse me, Jalanon, but I have a ship to tend to. Sophia sends me. She does, does she? Hmm. Listen, I have great respect for the dojo master, and you must be quite a tamer if she trusts you like that. But we're already fully crewed. I don't need another cabin, kid. You can always use a tamer. In the air? No, my friend. Up there, there are only the currents, the pan sun, and a big bag of hot air. That's all that stands between you and a plunge to the down below when you're an air sailor. However, listen, we're missing a passenger, the Omnignesian Dojo Master Tahani. If you can find her as soon as possible, I might squeeze you in the cabin somehow. Uh, where? Last time we spoke, she said she was heading to Turquesa. Something about some local variety of Tim Tim or some such. What does she look like? She looks like an Omnignesian Tim Tim scholar. What do I know? She probably changes clothes daily, as people do. Deal. Atta boy, now run to Turquesa and bring her back. We have to take off soon or we'll get delayed. Okay. Well, I'm guessing that's all the way across the map, right? How do I? Yeah, I have to keep going north and around. But we have a surfboard now. So that's a thing. Hmm. It said something about we could get to the fort faster if we took an underground route, I think. Hmm. So that makes me wonder, if I head back towards the fort, and then go in surfing, can I get back to the kiddos faster? Huh. Alright, dear viewer, we are up here near Windward Fort, and I have a scent active. You can see it right here. It seems to be step-based rather than time-based, which is nice. So we can go in here, check if there's anything we want. No. You lied to me. All right, what's this way? Hmm. Danger. Good thing we have two electric types. We fly? This is my private home. You are not supposed to be here without an invite. Okay. Or is this Jeffrey or something? Hmm. I don't know how to read that. I can't read, apparently. DC beam, save me. Twice. Okay, water. It hurts. Ah. So I think we won't be able to KO it. Yeah. Okay, so the Volto Puncture might have made some sense. Hmm. Is any of this faster? No. Well, we're gonna try. Unless, actually. Charge is same priority. Never mind. Nope, it's being smart and fast. And we. Electrocuted at last. Okay. Piranient is done. Good work, team. Beaten in my own patch. This should teach me a lesson. Alright. Enjoy your lesson. Will you pay me for teaching you? I guess you just did, actually. Oh well, welcome to my private bond, I guess. It was bound to happen anyway. It's not really private, you see. More like I was wishing nobody would find out about this cozy little spot here. Well, that's a pipe dream. With all those tourists milling around. What are you doing here? Not much, swimming a bit, chilling out. It's a great place to just be alone and think. Was. Please don't tell anyone about it. I don't want it to be overrun with people overnight. I'll let you enjoy it. Alright then. Hmm, there's another tamer. We are in danger. Whoa, I'm super rusty. Help me practice my Tim Tim skills? Okay. How do I pronounce this? Is that German? The umlaut? Busra? Bus Busra? Try to remember. 
Uber, right? It's just a longer U, so Busra? Hmm. Words. Chain lightning. I call upon you. DC beam. Uh, I call upon you as well. No, oh, gunky. Oh, you tried your best. Good work. Good work trying. All right. Scare a lot. You did even better work. Okay. Then we can get water, water everywhere, but not a drop to drink. Hmm. Who needs platypus? There we go. You need the XP. Maybe we can evolve you soon. Cypat, take that. Calibus. Enjoy alternating direct current. Because it was going to Cypat, but now it's alternated. That's how that works, right? Yeah, yeah. It's nothing to do with frequencies or voltages. Al, Aqua Stone. What? Okay. Well, apparently... Um, there's stones in that water. Somehow. Is that a kidney stone? That'd be kind of weird. Okay, Toxic Farewell. Ah! My HP! I need that. Okay. That was some A-grade Tim Timming right there. That's correct. A-grade indeed. Also, I should move you and you for now. Oh, I should talk to you, probably. Don't let that party paper get to you, dude. You're welcome here, as you are anywhere in Denise. Grumpy Gwee, I call him. Okay. The scent has dissipated, so we can activate it again, but I kind of want to find more water, Tim Tim, since I haven't caught more than Patapet, really. We can go over here. Oh. My. Three smoke bombs. And some tonics. And is there any, like, random stuff in here that's just different? Not really. Okay. It's a side hat. Good to meet you. Hmm. Even better to beat you. Let's see. Is that enough for the one shot? It is. Good work, Planet Pet. Excellent. Double level. We'll take the. Okay, nobody evolved. Sad. Okay, I don't see any sparkles in the grass, so I think we're done here. Oh, we have two side pads. Well, if only Chain Lightning was here. We'll just double up for now. Maybe we get the one shot? Yeah. Okay. Good work. Hey, a Toxic Affinity on Platypet is very good this early game. Okay, we're not quite powerful enough for a DC beam to one shot in. From Skywat. That's okay. Let's get some more Venomous Claws out there. And more beans. Okay. Here we go. XP. For you and for me. Well, not me, because I'm a human. But you know what? It'd be nice if I could level up. So can I go this way? No. Okay. So I was thinking maybe when they said it was faster to get there on a surfboard, we could do this and go all the way there. But no. Also, I think the dark blue you can't actually surf on because that dark blue is the hot spring. So I think that's just like a, a water feature of the map. Okay, maybe we find a Calibus out here then. Calibus, Calamari. Yes, an untamed FOMU. Well, okay, why not? Uh, we will sand splatter and voltopuncture. It shouldn't do too much, right? Oh my, that was a lot more than I thought. Oh dear. Oh dear. Just don't do much, don't do much. Okay. <laughs> Ice cubes. Scarawat, you did good. You did good. Take a break. Okay, Fomu is no longer seized. Let's take Saku, the Snaku. And let's get a Tim card. Or two. Yeah, we'll do two. Here we go. They're very low health. Hey. -o. You've got FOMU. So it has hydro... Look at that stamina though. 50! Okay, so I think that's the highest stat we've ever seen. Speed is very high as well, but everything else is meh. 
Hmm. Special attack is okay-ish. It's not my favorite, but I'll take it into the into the PC. I haven't double checked how much room I have, but I'm certain it's hacked. Kudo unlocked powerful Tim. What tab for details? What kudo? What do these do? First steps we get things for them. Okay. Interesting. Timpedia. Oh, uh -huh. capture or hatch each starter Tim Tim. I haven't gotten 20 species yet, but I'm on my way. Alright, I'm gonna surf a little bit around here, hope we get something else to pop up. And then we will see. Nope! Okay, nothing new. Still, might be a better farmer. Maybe I try. Yeah, this will probably take out Side Pat 1. Okay, this might KO. If it does, that's okay. That just means it didn't have enough stuff. Oh, it almost had enough stuff. But the poison zip pause all. Okay, well, Vomu, you almost stuck in there. But our toxic synergy was too much. Okay. Well, we will continue this away. Which should go to the fort. And then I'm betting there's a way through the fort to Turquesa. Unless I have to go back to get a ship. Oh. Is that possible? Or actually, I have my surfboard now, so maybe I just need to surf over to Turquesa? Hmm. Well, we'll double check over here that there's nothing crazy on the map. Does it have the quest marker anywhere? Let's zoom out a lot. It doesn't. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, that would have been helpful. Hmm. Okay. So we will go to Windward Fort. And just double check there's nothing showing up in there. Go ahead and get some rest, everybody. And I might buy a couple more scents. Maybe? Yeah, why not? Getting more of these and using more of them than I normally do in any of these monster taming games. Because mostly I just like to get the XP for a quick fight. Hmm. Okay, is it showing up on the map at all? No, it is not. No, it is not. Um, let's go down to the basement and just double check that there's nothing crazy saying, oh yeah, this is how you get to somewhere else. Ho, ho, ho. This goes up, but I want to double check there's like not anything showing up here. Nope. Okay. Well, we try. Hmm. Do you have anything? Windward Fort, historical buildings of Denise, unstable floors, no entry without curator permission. Eh. Okay. Yeah, that's the other thing about these scents, is it doesn't seem to be level-based, it just seems to be, you know... Does it do it less often for encountering? And it does do less often, but... Oh well. Alright, DC Beam. Finish them. Finish them. Those Marvel comics, I mean, scale. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Hmm. Let's go down, down, down to Goblin Town. No. No marker. Hmm. Can I jump across? Nope. Okay. Well, this is our last little thing that I might use a smoke bomb just to exit. But can I? I can go here. Which makes me think this might be correct. Let's go here first. And then Solaro River. Okay, it's not opening the map yet. Took a little time to load. So did I end up going... South? Where am I? I'm underneath. So yeah, I thought this would take me underneath, but... Just leads me over to here, maybe? Hmm. Well, we'll find something. Uh... So, oh, I kind of don't want to go to this Tim Tim Center. 
Because if I do, then my smoke bomb thingy would lead me out there. So let's go here first. Okay, uh, I will not use another one yet, because I kind of want to find new water tin. Maybe I will, maybe I won't. Oh, wait, that's sparkles in the water. Keep an eye out for those. Get some smoke bombs. Okay. Hmm. An untamed pukey. Okay. Hmm. So, Volto Puncture almost killed stuff. So, it's Sand Splatter. Um. I will do one nap time, one Volto Puncture. Because I think this won't. Yeah, okay. Good damage. There we go. Sand Splatter probably wouldn't have killed, but I don't know. Platypet's pretty tough. Platypet, get some rest. You've earned it. Okay. And then... Tim card. And then... That other Tim you know card. A Timothy card. Timotheus? Perhaps? A little bit Greek? We caught a pukey. Rested. Increases attack and special attack by 30% during the first two turns. What? That seems really good. And your attack is really high, your special defense. Speed's not as high as I'd like it to be. That works really well with your just large attack stat at the moment. Your special attack isn't great in the future, but hey, that's a future problem. Okay. Intriguing. Hmm. So I can't go that way. All right. That's the other thing. Okay, so this is literally just this area. Uh, oh, that's new. Koi, koi-ish? As in koi fish? Koi-ish? koi, -ish? koi, -ish? koi -ish? Uh, that might KO. Um, let's do a sand splatter on koi -ish and a voltopuncture on Kalazu. We'll see how this goes, but my guess is then I can do one Tim card on Kawazu and Sand Splatter again on Koish next turn. Never mind, that is terrible damage. Okay. So we'll do Volto Puncture on Koish next turn. Yeah. The Blades of Water. They death scar us. Hmm. Tim card. Kawazu. Volto Puncture. Koish. Okay. Yes. New friend. Here we go. You've got Kalazu. Hydrologist. A lot of speed on this Kalazu and special defense. Well, that's kind of a weird combo. Huh. To the tin deck with you. Okay. Perfect amount of damage on Koish. You done seized. I'm still not sure exactly what that does. I guess you can't leave combat, right? I forget. Well, Tim cards. Single and training values. Yep. Are right, unique and eight. An unchanging factor a Tim Tim has in each of their stats. One to fifty. So fifty is the maximum. Okay. Versus training values are what we can train. Yep. Each Tim Tim species grants a different one. Wind beated. So yeah, you can. HV or EV trained in Pokemon is what it's called. But yes, we're not going to worry too much about it. Ah, oh, it broke free with no effort, so it must be pretty hard to catch. Or we got unlucky. Or both. Hypnosis. I will take a nap, thank you. Scarewat, you did good. Get some rest. Oh, it damaged itself though. Oh my goodness. That was almost a self-KO. How could you? After all this hard work, Quish. Really? Really? Come on, join our friendship group. There's a book club. No! You don't like books! I guess they don't like moisture that much, yeah? Yeah? Okay, we try again. We have at least one more turn of Tim cards. Uh-huh. There we go. We've caught Koish. Ah, Synergy Adept. Whoa, that's speed and special defense. Man, we've gotten a lot of those. And decent special attack. 
Okay, that's interesting. Damage done with synergy techniques is increased by 15% while the Tim Tim participates in the synergy. That's nice. I don't think... We don't currently have anything that synergizes with water just yet. It's too bad your HP and stamina are kind of terrible, but with that speed stat, it might not matter. Hmm. Scarewat is no longer alerted. No. But yeah. So we want it to have a synergy with somebody else to activate the synergy with its high speed. Get an attack off before it dies. You know. Same old, same old. Another Koish and a Pukey. Hmm. I don't think we're going to care about the unique values at the moment. We're just going to try to get some more XP real fast. Mm -hmm. I do like you don't have to worry about power points from wild battles in this game. I, I really do like the energy system because it makes you have to be strategic with your choices while also rewarding you for having the stats you want. So it kind of rewards both sides of that. And it still makes battle strategic. Where you you know, you can't just fire a blast 20 times in a row or anything. Yeah. Okay. Well then, into the breach. Hey, it's that punk again. The one that challenged her ladyship. Let's avenge our mistress for Lady Lottie. Okay. Well, I think you need to find new bosses. The supervisors that are actually worthwhile. Hmm. This is bad for Planipet. I was worried for Scarabot with its low HP, but uh, this is worse. So 35 will be like 70. This gets my same type attack bonus. Pretty similar. Uh, we also move faster with this. Yeah. Let's go for Genki. Gank the Genki! It's more likely to die here, I think. Still not very likely. Yep. Okay. Test the prison. Platypet. Your beautiful face. Oh dear. Mm -hmm. Good night, Platypet. You did good. Oh man. Our enemies had the same plan I did, I suppose. Hmm. I think I go Smazy. Here we go, Smazy. Time to go crazy. Hmm. I think we just uppercut Sparzy. DC beam you. Okay, how much does this do? Yeah, good. I didn't have to waste stamina on the lower defense. We get rid of Gonki before it even attacks. Good. Tesla Prism. Okay, it is slowing me down. Last rush. Maybe that makes it move better if it goes last. That would make sense. Let's charge. That'll probably do the most damage. And it wasn't much. But hey, we appreciate it. Uppercut. Yeah. Scarewat would probably be a good supportive Tim Tim. Foiled again. Bill Soto shall prevail. Eh, probably not. What do you say now? Arg. Yep. Very piratical. Understood. Okay, more Bill Soda. We have Saku and Scarawat. That's a decent start. Her ladyship said it must be around here. Did she say also when we were getting paid or getting some rest? Faithless wretch, it's not for us to question her ladyship's priorities. All I'm saying is we've been on this exhausting task for days on end now. We should have some rights. Our cause is all that matters. How dare you? If this were really your passion, you'd be happy to work for her ladyship all day, every day. Uh, she's right. I know, right? Who are you? What are you doing here? This is a Bell Soto operation attack! Okay, well, rude. Psypat and Piranian. Okay, that's what Pukey will become one day. Hmm. Yeah, if I remember correctly, there's some weird laws in the works about, uh, what was it? Like getting rid of people being given lunch breaks and stuff? I think it was in Kentucky, which just sounded insane. You need people to eat, you know? Or else they can't even work. And then it's like, what? What are you doing? But anyway, weird politics aside, her ladyship sounds like a terrible boss. Okay, man. Paharak, get ready. 
All right then. I think we just DC beam Karate Ant. Hmm. Sharp Leaf or Urushiol should work. Well, Sharp Leaf, we have Botany. I'm a botanist now. Right? No, Scarawat. You did so good. You deserve that XP. <sighs> Fine. To Saku it will go. Good job, Saku. Okay, then we we'll probably get hit by wind. Thank goodness it only does half. Okay, good job, Saku. You leveled. Hmm. Let's take Gonki up for a spin to win. Two eye. Aha. Uh -huh. well, I kind of want a chain lightning. Could debris typhoon. But they're gonna take less damage from that, so we'll use Rushiol. We'll see if this matters. I probably should have hit the other one. Because Chain Lightning should be enough to KO the 2i, but I'm not sure. I want to do it certified that that would happen. Okay. So far, so good. The wind. It bursted. That does not sound good for the wind. DC Beam. And more Rushiel. Never mind. No need to visit the pharmaceutical department. The electronics team took care of it. This is a disaster. This is what happens when we're not treated right. I mean, yeah. Yeah. Your team didn't get tired. You only have like one. You get into random wild battles. Hmm. It's the same coish. Coish? Yes? Yeah. Yeah, okay. I don't think we need anything here unless we want it. Sure. Uppercut. Sure. Let's see. I am surprised Smazy has not reached an evolution yet. Okay. Iridescence. So that's different. We don't know what that does. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. It doesn't really matter which one we hit. It should KO. Um, who is slowest? Colossi? We'll do this. So Iridescence must be a defensive thing. Like maybe less special attack damage? Okay. Good enough. Good enough. Alright. Hmm. Nothing shining in the water? Hmm. I think I maneuver Smazy to Gonki. This is not what I signed up for when I was told we'd be helping her find that cache. Archaeology is hard work, Professor. We're so close to the XMR spot. This is not archaeology, but mere treasure hunting. Your Lady Lottie is a vulgar scavenger. Hey, who goes there? No witnesses. That's what Lady Lottie said. Uh, what's that going to mean for your archaeologist? Because that sounds pretty bad. I'm not gonna lie. You should find new employment, sir. Okay, I think Chain Lightning is pretty good here. Could Debris Typhoon. Sharp Leaf is probably my best bet. Chain Lightning. Aren't she bamboozling? Uh-oh. No! You can evade things. Okay, it's gone now, though. The Fierce Claw hurts. And it's gonna upgrade stuff, maybe? No? Oh, it wasn't enough to KO the Barnshee? Okay, well that's... that's sadness. Inducing. Hmm. 57... I think we still do more damage with Sharp Leaf with Botany, probably. Hmm. So I think I want to do that. And then actually, what is my fastest move? 3E priority? Yeah. DC beam. Okay. Take out the Barn G. Oh, there we go. Mm -hmm. Sharp leaves. Alright. No, Gonky. Aw, oh, man. 
Okay, yeah, it's not showing an attack up, but... Hmm. Can you just roll better on that attack? Because I thought we were at, like, 32, so it should have done, what, 24 damage the first time around? Hmm. Hmm. I'm going to send out two I. And Calibus. Hmm. Well, then. <sighs> I think... I will do a Shark Leaf on Calibus, a Wind Burst on Skunch, just to make sure it goes down, eventually. Okay, looks like Saku's defenses are coming into clutch. I guess I should have tried Peck earlier. No. I didn't think it'd KO. Good. The Botany compels you. Still alive somehow. Good job, Saku. <laughs> Level 28. Saku overexerted. Oh, I missed that. Um, I'm just going to switch you out for Smazy. We're going to Feather Gatling. And that should KO. I'd be very surprised if it doesn't. Alright, Smazy. Get some of that XP. Yeah. Eh, that's what I thought. Wait, how'd you damage yourself? I thought you had 22, right? I mean, the toxic farewell. Hmm. A disgrace with this whole thing is a disgrace, I say. I mean, you are correct. Okay. I should have never gotten involved with you lot. Careful now, Professor. That's dangerous talk. And if by any chance he were to get wind of your, let's say, lack of faith, then... Uh-huh. Well... I think it's time to use our Tumescence file. Yeah. 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 Okay. Your turn to dig. What? I've been digging all morning. Keep digging. No way. You keep taking bathroom breaks, and at this rate... Hey, watch out over there. Ah, this is where I come in. You'll regret this, stranger. Okay. Little lion dandy. <laughs> okay, this could be very bad for Planet Pets if we don't take out the Genki. So I think we take out the Genki. Can I? That's the real question. Uh, decent damage. Not quite. <gasps> Planet Pet, no! We tried so hard. Wait, it just destroyed itself. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. Poor Platter Pet. You'll catch up. I believe in you. Um. We'll take our Genki. Alright then. Hmm. I think I do more DC beams. Yeah. Okay. We just apply more direct current to the problem. It's not enough, though. Ouch. Toxicity. We get one less turn of toxins, though, so that's nice. Hmm. Windblade, maybe? It is more potential damage. Go ahead and do these. See how that goes. Yeah, it's not much. Not much. But at least they look cool. All right then. Good job, team. Take some poison damage, though. All right. Well done, genius. At least now we don't have to keep digging. All right then. Good job, genius. Here we go. A coward's cloak. Revolutionary Cogno Cloak that allows the Temptum holding it to gain experience from battle without even taking part in it. <laughs> Lost Clothing. Okay, well, I wonder, I highly doubt it, but I wonder if that would even work on somebody who was KO'd. Probably won't, right? Alright. Let's equip some gear so that you can catch up. And then I don't have a seal. Alright, we're going to move you back you and then I think I might use a revive 
I have a couple. I'd really rather not. But I will. This way you can get some XP. What? What do we tell Lady Lottie now? It was ten of them. And they all had level 20 pokets. It was dark and we were ambushed. Well, somebody has an imagination. Okay. Hmm. I think we're pretty happy, though, and we will probably call this an episode, dear viewer, after I catch this Umishi. Hopefully I can. Ah, uh, what would I hit you with? Drill Impact? Probably Drill Impact. Hmm. We'll make sure that one goes down. We can't charge or burrow yet. So I think I Voltopuncture you. Yeah, it's not up to KO. Seize the day. Okay, you go down. Good work, team. Water cannon. Arg. Hmm. No longer seized. Okay, now we just throw tip cards. It's your move, Mishi. So you should move into, you know, our little friendship club. You'll love it. No, you don't love it. No. Maybe you'll just like it. Oh, okay. Well, hmm. that did. That hurts. That hurts. You overexerted. You almost destroyed yourself. You almost played yourself. Mm -hmm. I almost played myself there too. Okay. Here we go. Tim cards. A one. Hey yo. You've got a Mishi. Caffeinated. Somehow, in the middle of the water. Hmm. Prevent sleep. Oh, that's pretty good. Very high attack and special defense. Special attack is kind of meh. So stamina and speed. Okay, well, you don't fall asleep, though. That's pretty good. Cool. All right, then. And then I just want to double check. Is there something... What is with this icon on the map? Why is this here? Is there a reason? Maybe just to show me there's something that I could collect here, which I did? But nobody's going to heal me, right? Okay, well, all right, dear viewer. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe for some more Tim Tim. Next time, we're going to figure out what's on the other end of this room. I hope you, dear viewer, have a great day.